Today is the 16th of March, Saturday. Some thunder rumbling off in the distance, uh, fixing the rain. And I had a uh, erosion area here in my parking lot. So I went and got some coal patch asphalt. Here comes the rain. And also got some uh, two by six by eight foot treated to work on the wife's raised bed gardens there at the house. And I got some elastomer polymer roof coating material. It's pretty reasonable in price. I get that from Amazon, but the price at the big box store got pretty reasonable. Now what I did on my patch, we shut this door the rain blowing in. What I did on my patch, use this concrete crack sealer as a bonding agent on the edge of the crack or the erosion area and the bottom of it. This stuff sets up pretty good, real sticky. And then uh, trialed in my uh, coal patch material and worked it with my vibratory plate compactor. And that seemed to work pretty good. You saw how the patch looked. So we'll see how it holds up over time. This is APOC Elastometric Roof Patch 264, $31 a gallon, and UV resistant, retains flexibility, coatable, real good adhesion. It's got white, the roof is white on the outside. Where that yellow circle is there on the floor, is the leak area I got that that's a reoccurring leak I think I'll get it stopped when it shows up again irritating and one of my neighbors is out uh, putting out his pre-emergent I stopped to talk to him and asked him if he had any moles in his yard and he said he just noticed a couple runs today well I got this thing I made and told him about my mold minoxinator. I'm going to bring it over, bring it back to the house. I'm not going to charge him, he's my neighbor. I'll show him how it works and see if he can gas some of his molds too. He's got outside cats, so he doesn't want to use poison, of course. And he also has medium sized children, so they don't need to be around any kind of poison either. So I'll get with him tomorrow and let him gas some molds. See if he likes it. And what else? Garden not doing much of anything right now. No sun. It's all cloudy days because of all the rain. And I was using my backpack blower to blow those sweet gum balls out of the parking lot. And I need a wand extension. I might have one up at my farm. Amazon has one for $17.98. We'll be here next Wednesday. They get kind of stuck as they get dirt around them on the asphalt. And uh, can't hardly get them up without a broom. So I squat down and get more air on them. They pop right out. So want extension. Uh, some prices. Uh, two by six by eight foot treated were 778 each so that price has come down a lot the uh, quick 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 read quick Crete product the concrete crack sealer is down to 1273 of course I get a discount a uh, veteran so 10% off these prices I'm telling you the uh, last metric roof patch 
was with my discount uh, $31.48 a gallon not bad the uh, 50 pound sack of cold mix asphalt $18 and a nickel with my discount yeah not bad so just trying to keep this parking lot alive as long as I can at some point I'm going to have to have it tore up and lay down more asphalt I really don't want to do that so I'll just keep on uh, repairing it yeah. I think uh, I couldn't even get a quote last time I asked two asphalt companies to quote it they wouldn't even give me a damn price too small a job don't want to fool with it that'll change when the economy goes south as it's doing right now hence the price drops on materials at the big box store so still early We've got nothing really to do inside the building now that it rained I can't get up on the roof and slather on some of my stuff too late now I have to do that on a sunny day it works better but at least I got my parking lot patch and uh so yeah that's pretty much all for this one. Thank you.